Imagine sailing through ice and freezing weather in fear of getting frostbite or capsizing or in fear of getting scraped against an iceberg. That is what it felt like to be in Henry Hudson's fleet. Henry Hudson made four trips, one in 1607, one in 1608, and one in 1609. He disappeared on his last voyage in 1610. Hudson wanted to find gold and spices and a lot of other things. Hudson went on his first voyage in May 1607. His first boat was called the Hopewell, and his crew was his 16-year-old son, John. Henry was born in London, England, in a very wealthy family. He faced ice in almost every voyage that he went on, but on his fourth voyage, fortunately, he didn't meet ice in his last voyage, but unfortunately, his crew mutinied and sent him adrift. They kept sailing north until they ran into ice. It didn't change that much when Henry Hudson came to the New World. On his second or third expedition, he met some natives, and they were friendly and traded with them. The natives traded gold and silver with Henry Hudson, and his fleet traded riches and furs with the natives. In conclusion, Henry Hudson never accomplished his goal to find a northwest passage between Russia and Asia, but he made his place in the Hall of Fame because he discovered one of the most famous rivers in America called the Hudson River and a bay called the Hudson Bay. Thanks for reading this documentary.